Ask Reddit Thread, what should everyone go do right now if they haven't yet? Check your thyroid. All you need is a mirror and a glass of water and it could help you catch thyroid cancer early on. If you catch it early, there is basically a 100% survival prognosis. Why not take a quick look? I'm 22 and I just found out I have a 7 centimeter thyroid tumor, which would have never gotten to the size if I had checked earlier. Now I'll need more surgery and treatments than I would have needed. Clicks link, block my work, guess it's chemo for me then. Allow me to perform the blatant copyright violation. Hold the mirror in your hand. Focus on the lower front area of your neck, above the collarbone, and below the voice box, Larax. Wait, Larnix? Your thyroid gland is located in this area of your neck. Uh, while focusing on this area in the mirror, tip your head back, take a drink of water, and swallow. As you swallow, look at your neck. Check for any bulges or protrusions in the area when you swallow. A reminder, don't confuse the Adam's apple with the thyroid gland. The thyroid gland is located further down on your neck, closer to the collarbone. You may want to repeat this process several times. If you do see any bulges or prostitutions, protrusions in this area, see your physician. You may have an enlarged thyroid gland or a thyroid nodule that should be checked to determine whether further evaluation is needed. Alright, so you can do your at-home thyroid check. Install a CO detector. Saves lives. CO, of course, stands for uh, carbon monoxide, right? I think so. <sighs> but I already have mech <laughs> Am I still protected? No, and it's likely you're not protected from viruses either. <laughs> what CPU usage is the virus going to have left to be able to infect anything meaningful? Uh, back up your data. Do it now because you won't need to do it. It's already too late. I see it all the time. I don't have time to do a backup. But you're going to have all the time in the world to cry about it after you lose it. 10 push-ups. It'll wake you up. Ugh, 10 push-ups are hard though. Uh, drink water. Up until now, I straight drank water and breathe air. Doing good. Oh, wait, I remember back in high school. Uh, in order to play defense on football, you had to do at least 100 push-ups in a row. So we did like a test to see who was ready to do it. And I got to 50, and I decided to rest my arms real quick. So I threw one in the air, so that way I could shake it out, because it was stiff. And my other arm gave out, and I hit my head in the floor. I was like, well, 50 push-ups is enough. <laughs> uh, I can't do that anymore. <laughs> I can probably do 10 now since I don't work out at uh, strength train anymore. I go running, but I don't work out anywhere near as much as I used to. 10 is probably my max now. But back in the day, 50 before I slammed my face in the floor when I was trying to rest my arm. Drink water. Oh, yeah, I already read that. Uh, take the clothes off of the washer and put them in the dryer. Comment. Now, two hours old and I still haven't changed the laundry. <laughs> I set little reminders on my... Uh, on my Firefox, I have an extension where you can set reminders at specific times. Whenever I do laundry, I just set that. Actually, you know what? I need to do laundry today now that I think about it. I'm almost out of clothes to wear. Uh, I'll do it tomorrow. Uh, I'll do it tomorrow. A reminder for tomorrow. Yeah, you got me, except now I've got to go and hang them on a rail, like some sort of smuck. <laughs> At least you have a rail. I had mine, wait, I hang mine on the backs of chairs and stuff. At least you have chairs. I have to tape them to the wall. <laughs> At least you have tape. I use nails. This isn't practical. At least you have nails. I have to fucking throw it on my chest. <laughs> And run to keep it from falling and getting dirty again. <laughs> at least you have time. I can only afford to wash one item at a time and put it on that day and make it dry off. <laughs> at least you have. I can only take my clothes to the laundromat. At least you all have clothes. <laughs> Say thank you to someone who's done something good in your life. Thank you, mom and dad, for making me exist. He said something good. <laughs> Wrecked. <laughs> Start saving for retirement. Bull. Honky. 
What's a good minimum amount to set aside every month? Aim for 20%. Other advice. Max your 401k or equivalent employee contribution. Buy inexpensive, well-diversified mutual funds such as Vanguard, Target, 20XX. Never buy or sell individual security. Person on the other side, oh, that sounds all boring. I'd rather use my money when I'm young rather than when I'm old. Save that file you were working on. Make a backup while you're at it. Uh, I just got a new terror, uh, five terabyte hard drive. I should probably like use that to back up my computer. Uh, brush your teeth. Don't forget flossing. Flossing's annoying though. I brush my teeth every day, but I don't really even have floss. Take care of their bodies. You only have one. Sorry, there seems to be many people that have more than one body. Take care of all of them, please. Also, some of you appear to be aliens. Are you over 22? If so, this is for you. Start learning how and why to. Make your will, make your final arrangements, directives, make your advanced medical directive. After you know what these things are and why you may need them, make them, tell someone who is responsible where they are, and then rest a little easier. A few of us expect to die this week, some of us will, and all of us will die eventually. I ain't got nothing left in my will, except throw it all in the casket, it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Go watch TV. Wubba lubba dub dub. Hunting vampires with my grandkids. Woo, Tiny Rick. And uh, that's the way the news goes. Do I really need to document to everyone who should inherit all my negative money, though? I hereby leave all my negative debt to Son of Fair Sea. No backsees. Everyone, all at once, let's take the American group and go fire Congress. Viva la revolution. Help my reddit turn Spanish. Uh, finally start that diet, exercise, and lose the weight. Trust me, it's the biggest confidence boost in the world. It so is. I started dying slash counting calories a couple weeks ago. I also take my dog for walks every day. I've dropped 10 pounds already. I feel amazing already. You must have been really fat if that's all it took for you to lose weight. I'm actually reading this while I wait for my appointment at the gym today. I've never even been to one before. I'm excited, but also scared. Uh, let's see. Oh, actually, I didn't go running today. I Instead of going running, I went to the store to buy a new hat. Because I need a hat to go running with. Because I sweat a lot. And I have two hats already, but one of them only fits when my hair is short. And I really need to go get a haircut. So I could go get a haircut, that way I could wear one of my hats while I'm on my run. But I'd rather just buy a new hat for when my hair does get longer. Because I don't like getting my hair cut like every uh, couple months. And then I have a second hat which I like to wear when I take my dogs on walks or I go to the store. And that one I don't like to sweat in. So I don't really want to use that one to go running with. So I kind of need a second hat since one of them is too small if my hair is too long so I had to go buy that today but yeah it's, I usually go running every day Ugh, the thing with running uh, once you make a habit of it your body will actively want to go so it's not as hard it's hard at first definitely but after a while you get used to it and then your body will even crave to go after a while it's pretty nice but you have to make it consistent like do it the same time every single day so you it's pretty hard if you have a busy schedule where you can't really devote a specific time every day including weekends I usually take one day off but since I took today off I'm not gonna take the weekends off turn off Wi-Fi assist on your iPhone iOS 9 cost me an extra 145 on my phone bill due to data usage alone edit just so people know go to the bottom of sell your data settings you'll find at the bottom what is this Wi-Fi assist you speak of? And where do I find it? Not that it's a problem with my included data every month, but wouldn't hurt to turn it off. Found it. It's all the way at the bottom of the cellular setting. Uh, seeing as no one's actually answered your questions, apparently it's a feature which you automatically use your mobile data when your Wi-Fi sucks. Seems like a terrible thing to have on by default, but hey, at least your YouTube viewing won't be interrupted. Uh, as many have said, this is a useful feature if you have a good data plan. That's why I said seems like a terrible thing to have on by default. Okay. Sit up straight. Edit. Obligatory edit. Thanks, kind stranger. Blah. I don't, I don't, I don't even know why I tried reading that. 
You got me. I slouch. I slouch all the time. You can't tell me what to do. You're not my mom. Take a minute to sit silently. Uh, what about the voices in my head that tell me to do stuff? Turn the stove off, but I'm cooking. Not for long. Breathe. I don't know how you've got to this point, but trust me, you need air. Get off of Reddit and do that thing you're procrastinating on. Ah, uh, you see. Reading Reddit is actually what I'm supposed to be doing right now, so that doesn't apply to me. Since I'm making a video about this. So, I'm pretty sure this is like everyone else in the world who's reading this thread, except for me. I don't have to write a speech. Yet. Get off friend, do the thing you're procrastinating on. Work? No. Uh, say hi to her. Thank you for your wise words, Bill Clinton. Hi, hi. Uh, stands awkwardly for what feels like hours before rapidly walking away. <laughs> oh, someone's socially awkward. Plant a tree. The best time to do it is 20 years ago. The second best time is now. Also, learn how to multi-shine as Fox and Falco. <laughs> It's mess reference out of nowhere. <laughs> Definitely do that though. <laughs> multi shine. I have no idea what that is. How does one multi shine? I've seen West Balls do it so many times and it's beautiful. I'm still trying to learn how to wave dash. Pff, noob. Me too, man. I have success with it like a fourth of the time and they aren't even good wave dashes. Then there is a the whole aspect of actually incorporating it into actual gameplay. I've got a long way to go. Ha <laughs> ha. So basically there's only three or four frames that Fox slash Falco braces for the jump once you hit the bottom. As soon as those frames have finished, press down B. Wait, I think another four frames and jump again. Wait for the four frames to be over and shine again. Basically you're jumping out of a shine so fast that the character doesn't ha doesn't leave the ground and instead shines again. West Balls does, doesn't do perfect multi shines, he does multiple double shines that he resets and downwards wave dashes just so y'all knows I don't know what any of this means uh, I'm, I mean I know what some of it means I just don't know what shine sparking is have an orgasm if you are one of the few people in the world who have never had an orgasm go and find a way to getting one they feel amazing right now I'm sort of at work hasn't stopped me uh, wipe your ass shit's nasty <laughs> Take a big glass of water. You know, you feel thirsty since you woke up. You feel like you have this small headache and you don't understand why. Your mouth feels weird and dry. Pet a dog. Give them some nice butt scratches. Rub those furry ears. Find their leg kicking happy spot. Scrunch up their adorable heads in your hands and give them a big wet one on the nose. Just did this and my dog got up and went to another spot on the couch to chew a toy. <laughs> Sorry for interrupting. <laughs> Dogs never recuperate on the butt scratches though. I don't know. My dogs love any form of attention. Take three minutes, set a timer, and do nothing but sit and breathe. Just do nothing. Put your phone on airplane mode for a minute. Mute your computer and turn away from it if possible. Just sit there. Try to be aware of your breathing without forcing it. And the sounds around you. When other thoughts come up, try really hard not to follow them. Just acknowledge that you're having that thought and go back to observing. Try to do this every day. It's so important to know what your mind is doing and to know that you are not your thoughts. Oh, so basically meditate because it helps you if you're like, I don't know, stressed or something. This is basically meditation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's great for reducing stress and has health benefits. <laughs> the thing is, people don't think meditation is like legit. It's great for your mental health. Uh, go watch Band of Brothers. This advice was given to me a month ago in another thread, so I did, and it was awesome. Sounds lame. Play a musical instrument. No. Call your parents and tell them you love them. Nope. Become an organ donor. I have been an organ donor since becoming an adult, but this comes to mind because I just had a 14-year-old cousin pass away because of a freak asthma attack. As terrible as it was, there was... Some solace in knowing how many lives he saved by his family agreeing, as they said he would have, have wanted to, donate his healthy organs. The opportunity to bless other families with continued life when they have possibly given up all hope is the kind of selfless act that lets us believe. If only for a brief, fleeting moment that people as a whole are inherently good. Well, I mean, they are. It's just, there's, uh, people are more likely to remember bad things. Society wouldn't really work if everyone was a dick. 
It's because people are generally nice to each other that, you know, we have cities and shit. But to think that there is no bad people in the world is just naive. It's just the good people far outnumber them. Whew, it's just we only tend to remember the bad stuff because it's how our brains are wired. How about if I just sign up to be an organ donor instead? I don't think it's such a great idea to become a donor right now. <laughs> uh, how come you're not an organ donor by default? It's such a pain. Get your shit together. Get it all together and put it on a backpack. All your shit so it's together and you gotta take it somewhere. Then take it somewhere, you know? Take it to the shit store and sell it or put it in the shit museum. I don't care what you do. Just go get it shit together. Rick and Morty. 100 years Rick and Morty. This is a tangent, but pretend there's a house fire coming and you have to pick everywhere you really must save from your house. Check how hard some things are to save and place them somewhere easier. I'm putting this on a poster. Upvote for Rick and Morty references. Lick, 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 lick my balls. Don't forget to add some fuck to it. Strike up a conversation with a total stranger. It's nerve-wracking, but it really makes you feel connected with the world. Nothing makes me more... Uh, wakes me up more than accidentally talking to someone in the subway on my way to work. Hey, man, how's it going? Oh, fuck, sorry. It was an accident to talk to you. Sorry. <laughs> When I'm drunk, I I talk to strangers all the time. Drinking helps. Watch Rick and Morty. My man, only if you pay me 25 smeckles. Only if you pay me 3,000 florbores. Blips and chips. Let's see. Oh, Rick and Morty's so good. This is the best advice in here. I agree, bitch. Ah, oh, bitch. Wubba lubba dub dub. Ricky Ticky, tavy, bitch. Grass tastes bad. Burger time. AIDS. Shit on the floor. Get swifty. Damn, I already put on my running shoes and was about to go grab my iPod, but I kept scrolling. Ricky and Morty Marathon, it is. <laughs> uh, put that thing back where it came from, or so help me. So help me. Go use your .edu school email to get free shit. I know about free Microsoft Office, but what else can you get? Well, for me, 50% off Spotify is amazing. Oh, what? I don't use Spotify, though. I was more like, I wonder what you can get for free with your EDU email. Uh, I know I got reduced price on Amazon Prime once with it. That was neat. Not anymore, though. Uh, Alright, that's it for this.